few days ago, I responded to a tweet from one of my YouTube heroes, Roberto Blake, instructing us to send him a video and ask him anything. I made a quick video and posted it, and then not long after, he responded with some great advice that I decided not to follow. My question had to do with challenging myself to post content on five platforms every day for 30 days. I asked whether I should focus on one topic or if it was okay for me to be more general. He advised focusing on a specific topic and posting at the same time every day. He's right, it's easier to gather meaningful data when there are fewer variables. By focusing on a specific topic and posting at the same time every day, I could rule out the when and the what as factors in my content's performance. But I decided not to do that, and here's why. Listening to Roberto's advice helped me get clarity on my goals. I could try to gather data to better understand the why behind how my content performs over the next 30 days, but my primary goal is to build a consistent habit of sharing content. Now, I could possibly do both, but it's likely that my efforts to build a habit would suffer. If I'm not successful in building consistency, data is useless. So I'm not following Roberto's main advice, but another piece of what he shared was instrumental in helping me get started. He said, if you want to do this for freedom of expression and see what you're capable of, you can obviously do different topics. It is obvious. I can talk about whatever I want if I'm not worried about the results. But this piece of advice gave me the permission I needed to move forward. So really, I am following Roberto's advice because like any great question answerer, he was able to answer in a way that provided context and helped me clarify my goals. I'm still curious about the results, but I no longer feel weighed down by the expectations. This freedom from having expectations about the results is exactly what I need to build consistency. There will be plenty of time in the future to optimize and measure and adjust, but for today, I made a piece of content, and that's enough.